Well, good morning and happy Sunday. Technically, it's just a little bit after morning, but I did wake up before noon on a day when I didn't have to work, which is like a miracle because my sleep schedule has been so bad. Um, so like I said, it's just after noon. I think I'm going to go make myself a breakfast drink and then um, what am I going to do? Putter a bit and then I'm going to shower before it's time for the Discord movie watch thing um so that should be it should be fun it should be it should be great it should be a good time um and then i think maybe later we'll do laundry but i also have a little list of things to do a lot i i actually worked really hard yesterday at getting a lot of stuff done like i record it edit it and posted all my puns for the week so like that's cool um so I think I actually don't have a ton to do, which would be a nice change. But yeah, so I'm going to go get a breakfast drink, do some stuff, shower, because my hair is so gross, and then we'll go from there. Also, last night, so sorry, not last night, night before, it only got down to 29 degrees. The night before, that was 28. Tonight, last night, it got down to 27, so that's when I still hate it. Okay, so it's now just after one, I think. I guess I need to take off the watch because I'm about to jump in the shower. Um, but I got all my um, clips for my shorts channel posted through the end of August. So we've almost got to the point where we're covered for blind channel, which will be extremely nice. But now it's shower time and then I'll probably just like slowly putter and then it'll be movie time. I'm a little bit stressed because I've never done a movie before, but only like four people have RSVP'd, including myself, so I'm sure it'll be okay. Laundry is done, and I've put it here in hopes that I will fold it. Should I lay in it? Because my room is hot and it is hot, but it's just so cozy. Just so cozy. Anyways, the movie was really good. Um, we watched Encanto. I haven't seen Encanto fully through. I'd only seen like maybe like the first third of it almost cried a couple times <laughs> thoroughly enjoyed it there's I think there was like five of us four or five of us for the majority of it and then a few people came kind of in and out um, randomly so that was good and then oh, we got to talk to Wesley for a bit and we did more k1 visa stuff I think I think I think I think we have everything ready he just has to pick up the money order or however they want to be paid and um, get his passport photo style visa style thing for it um and then we are good he's gonna send it off on tuesday uh oh oh my, my screen just made weird things anyways it's been a good day I've been pretty productive i think i do want to do some sewing i just ordered in some some food we're gonna get some kfc a boneless bucket so we get chicken strips which are delicious and popcorn chicken which i love and french fries which also good <laughs> And then after that, I'll probably maybe fold some clothes. Actually, you know what? If I was being responsible, I would fold clothes while I wait for the food. Hmm. Maybe we'll do that. And then I want to sew afterwards because I do have those bags. Yeah. They're right here. I think I have I've one, two, three, four more to sew. Yeah, four more to sew. And if I take care of those and then I can spend my other crafting time that I have working on like more bookmarks, which I got things, more of those pouches and uh, more keychains and stuff, which I want to do for Blind Channel. But whew, it's like just over three weeks until I go out and I'm getting a little stressy. Just a little stressy, but it'll probably be okay. Alrighty, and now we sew. It's very exciting. I laid down for like I'd say close to an hour after dinner. I was just scrolling TikTok and it felt good texting with uh, one of my coworkers from Blind Channel who's currently out there. Um, but we're gonna start with the purple bag and it's actually super convenient because this purple here works very well. Like it's the same kind of tone as this one. It's a little bit darker, but that's fine. And it works for this too. So it's a win, 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 win. So yeah, I just need to like, you know, move my mic boom and get a movie or a, a YouTube show on, YouTube show. <laughs> my boomer youtube video on um and then we'll see how much we can do it's 8 30 now we'll see if we can do at least two bags tonight maybe maybe Alrighty, we have bag number one done i love it it's so pretty and then we have bag number two which is a recreation of one that i made last year that sold so yes good and then 
it's like 11:30 right now and so i'm gonna do my dad my dadish my daily dadish here at 12 as i almost said noon and then i think i'm gonna try to sew this bag because then all i have left is um the bag for jessica and if i don't get it done before i get up on channel not the end of the world and then that way i don't have to sew bags on tuesday but i can do my fun cricket stuff so i think that's the plan uh, we can get out that's that thread and then i'll i think i have a gray that matches this maybe i don't know i think i used a beige to be honest oh you know what i have a beige it's down here somewhere i bet you that was the one Ooh, i think so all right so that is the plan for the remainder of the evening and then i will have five bags to sell which i think is good because i had three last time i sold them all so we up it a bit Alrighty, so it is like 125 and i am working on the third bag of the night i have the liner done already i would say that's one of my most annoying parts because i have to do the pocket and then also i have to remember to not sew it all the way across the bottom because that's how you flip it inside out i'm currently working on the straps for the bag and then um i just gotta do like the straps obviously um but it's kind of like a quilted bag but it's not fully quilted it's just like got the fleece for extra body and so you do the seams and the seam and then sew it together and then sew everything together i figure i have probably just under an hour left so hopefully i can be in bed around 12 30. i do work tomorrow but i anticipate i anticipate it being one of those like really exciting days um where i don't actually have to work for the full hours like full four hours like I'm anticipating it being like a a two hour event which will be super exciting because then I can come home I can eat some KFC some popcorn chicken which is leftovers if I want to or maybe like maybe have a nap and then do the KFC um and so it should be should be a chill day tomorrow I don't like to bank on the only two hour days because sometimes it goes terribly awry <laughs> um but fingers crossed um, today's just been like a really good chill day that my, my soul definitely need it. So that's really exciting because I think in the last vlog I mentioned how I've been like feeling super overwhelmed with like how much stream is blowing up and stuff and how busy that is and, and how like Discord also requires more of my attention and thought. Well, like my, my Discord, obviously not Discord, like Discord's not like, hey, Tiffany, pay attention to us. No, but like the actual like my server. So yeah, I'd really like to have like two incredible, well, three incredible mods. Um, just Wesley's quite busy with other things now, so I'm really lucky to have um, my two mods. One that I just tapped, who is phenomenal. Like the social aspect, like me and my other mod were talking about prior to tap to asking her to be a mod. Like if we if if she needed help, if I need another mod, and she's like, I'm totally fine. It's good. Um, but oh my god, first of all, she fits in so well, and she's so social, and she's like, she's not mean in chat, but if people are talking about things like, that are maybe inappropriate, or they're talking about like, another stream, or something, she'll be like, how about you just DM that person, and I'm like, over here like, mm, the tea, because I would never say that, I'm too nice, but no, it's really good, she does in the most polite way, of course, but no, like the, like my, initial mod said that I was talking to who's been helping me with all the stuff she was like didn't realize we need like that social aspect because it's phenomenal anyways I know she's probably gonna watch this eventually I see you there um but I'm gonna continue sewing and watching random just like I'm just going through my watch later list oh my god there's almost 500 videos on it <laughs> am I gonna watch all 500 of these probably not but that's what I'm working on um and yeah, it's just been a really good day, which I certainly need it because, you know, it's been a, it's been a lot lately. <laughs> I finished a little later than anticipated because I um, messed up a seam and so I had to go back and fix it. But I've lost an entire bobbin. I don't know where it went. And like, the bobbin is this color and it's got thread on it. So it should be quite visible. It's got a light colored thread on it. But I don't know where it went. I like pulled it out of my machine and I was like oh let me give my bobbin holder like a quick brush down and I don't know where it's gone and now I really have to pee so I don't have time to look for it right now but like also I'm so confused I'm just I'm so confused okay I've peed <laughs> so now 
I can look better. So I keep finding also these clips that I kept dropping. Uh, better than dropping a pin, which I did drop a pin and I've never found it again. Good for my feet, I guess. I thought Wesley was gonna step on it while he was here. So I'm gonna get a look. Oh, it's the cover for my tweezers that I lost and another clip and my slipper that I lost and another clip. <laughs> I don't think the bobbin fell down. Got some, we'll just, I, I know where that is. Um, I just, I don't know where it could have gone. I'm so confused. And I checked in the sewing machine, like, did I put it back in? And I didn't, so. <sighs> Ooh. <laughs> oh, hey, look. <laughs> you know what? Fruitful trip down here, I will say. I found this piece of Lego, which I don't think I needed it for anything. But this is from my London Eye, which I've been missing since the day I built it. And I found this frog that I didn't even know had fallen down, so there's that. Okay, well. <gasps> the bobbin! I don't even know how it got over there, but we found it. Heck yeah. Okay, honestly, good haul. You know, after celebrating finding my bobbin, I was a responsible girly and I put away my laundry, except for the stuff that I need to hang slash goes in the closet. I never do that. In fact, <laughs> didn't have to do it all last time because I just kept wearing it. Um, but yeah, I'm in my little wind tunnel. Fan, fan, fan. And uh, hopefully we'll get to sleep here pretty quickly. Um, it's three o'clock, which means I'll get like four -ish hours of sleep, which is, you know, not bad. It's been worse. Um, <laughs> anyways, thanks so much for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button because I do post every... Wait, what days? I changed it recently, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. And you know, if you really like this face and you're interested in the streaming side of things, that's every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 7 p.m. PST. But yeah, I'll see you around. Have a fantastic existence. And um, I'll please see you the next one. Bye.